All right, so I should be sleeping, but let's try the first run through with Umbra and we'll do Steigen Guard. Depart. Let's figure out how these ones work. Immortal Trade, apply Life Steal 3 and Ember Drain 2 to a friendly unit. Ember Drain is scary. At the start of your turn, lose one Ember, I think, or Energy, I don't know. It's probably called Ember. For every stack of Ember Drain, drain decreases every turn. When a unit with Lifesteal attacks, it restores health equal to the damage dealt. Okay, so that works with big units. At least the Ember Drain goes down every turn, so that's not so bad. But still, that's two scary turns, and there's two of this spell. Equal to... What does Lifesteal 3 mean? Like, Lifesteal 1 would be full health, or whatever, however much damage it does back in health. Does it get three times the amount? Or just Lifesteal 3 times total? Okay. Deal 20 damage to a random enemy unit four times. Slay, gain two energy. This is expensive, but holy crap. Big damage. Okay. When you play your third card of the turn, draw two. Units cost negative two energy. Let's take this. Third card, two draw is nice, but cheap units okay life steal 2 I still don't understand what life steal means when attacking oh XX damage is applied to subsequent enemy units is nice gorge triggers when the unit eats a morsel unit I think we take this we'll learn how life steal works All right, they get plus four attack. For a draft unit of the spell people, not the best. Of the Stygon Guard. Add a common or uncommon morsel unit to your hand. He takes up three spaces. So my only worry is I think morsels take a space. And I don't know how to eat them. Oh, for the next two attacks, that is how it works, okay. Like, will he only eat morsels in front or behind? Or anywhere? So, quick lesson on morsels. Yes, I am ready for that. Mainly just, is there a place I have to put them? <laughs> and... Beyond that, I'm going to end up doing that. The train steward doesn't help. Morsels are eaten end of turn by the forwardmost non-morsel unit on the floor. Okay. So, sounds like it can be behind him. Maybe. We'll see. Eaten. Okay. Gains energy. Yeah, because that's what he does. End the turn. Forward must non morsel unit on the floor. Of course, the morsel has to live to the end of the turn to get eaten, so place appropriately. Okay. Damn, I need a way to kill that, and I don't think I have one. Ember Drain's kind of scary. <laughs> so, this should do 
a lot of damage. I don't know if it hits the same enemy unit four times. Let's find out. Oh no, that hits everybody. Cool, they got me some money. Ember Drain 2 is a little bit scary. Would give him more lifesteal. It's free to play my stewards. The stewards don't do a whole lot. Right now I have a ton of energy, but I'm not about to. Okay. He dies. Why does he do no- oh, because this guy heals it all back. That makes sense. We have a ton of life steal. We have very little energy. We could do more. Okay. Damn, I can't use two of my morsel things here. I also can't do that. Damn, damn, damn. Gain energy. Well, I mean, that's nice since I have Ember Drain. So once he's up here, ah, this is going to be bad. Especially because the healer's still there and alive. I could kill him. I cannot kill the guy behind him. With the train steward, he'll just die. I think we're just taking some damage here. So the question is, I think it's more worth it to take the full... Ah, it's going to be two hits to kill this guy with this heal. I think it's worth it to take. So 12 plus 8, 20 damage to get this guy down to like half health. Except he'll also be getting healed. Damn. Still, I don't have a way to do damage to him. We're doing it. Oh, he gets knocked back, so now at least we get to kill the healer. I didn't pay attention to that part. Might as well put the steward out. End the turn. Let's see. Umbra is super fun. I played my arena quietly tonight. Think... That was bad luck. Ended one and three. No. At least you got five and three yesterday, and I think three and three for the second. So overall, it sounds like you're pretty break even between yesterday and today. That card with the Ember Drain might be your answer to the end boss. You're basically immune while you have lifesteal if you do 30 damage or more. Oh, that's true. I wasn't thinking about he'll heal back. So really, I should have avoided that pyre damage. Yes, I was not thinking at all. So train steward being in the back would be okay right now. Really, I could have just played the crypt builder too. It doesn't matter though. He's already dead. I was not thinking about the lifesteal. That's really good versus the boss. Okay. Apply Rage 2, Ember Drain 2 to a friendly unit, gain 2 energy. That's interesting. Add 3 uncommon or rare morsel units to your hand. I like that these cost 0. Rage 2 isn't the best. Deal 3 damage. Slay. Add 2 uncommon or rare morsel units to your hand. So this is basically like, oh, what's it called? <laughs> the flame, whatever, the thing that does two damage, firebolt or whatever. This is like a firebolt, and if it kills, then it gets two morsels. That's kind of nice, because I don't have a way to pick off damage anywhere. I actually kind of want that. Let's see. Need 31 life, 30 damage. Not sure what variant you took, 
but look for more life damage on him. Yeah, that would be nice. And Tumbra Assault is good one. I didn't see which one I got. Ah, I got... Yes, okay, cool. Deal damage either on your own morsel to multiply it or on a backliner. Okay. Yeah, backliner is what I'm mostly going for, but I see what you're saying. Could take out my own morsel for one energy to get two morsels. Okay, frost. This one's nice because I can use it on a backliner or I can apply eight frostbite. Spell weakness doesn't do much for me at this point. I mean, actually it does with Crypt Builder. Or with this. God, that slay when it kills a bunch of units. Wow, actually. This might be nice. Let's take that. That works good with those big spells. And my units are pretty free to play because of this. Or at least they're pretty cheap. When you summon a morsel unit on this floor, create a copy. So create a copy just means in my hand, I assume. Sweep. Strike, apply three frostbite to the attacked unit. Sweep is nice. It's between these two. I like that this guy doesn't take up much space because my big guy is big. But I can only fit, I think, my big guy, a morsel, and him. I can't fit two morsels. I need more room. Sweep with Frostbite. If I get quick on her, she takes out a lot of stuff. Let's see. Uh, on the floor, it can even overstack capacity. Oh, okay. No, that's pretty big then. The Morsel Master can overstack capacity when it... Okay. Multiplies the Morsel. Then I'm taking him. We're going Morsels. Spells or Merchant of Steel. Merchant can't get him up. Spells could get this up, could get... I have a bunch of spells that are decent. Some of my spells aren't great for the damage. I need something to discard this. But if I can make this cheaper, for example. Morsel Master is the only one that I would want to get up, but he's not my big damage. Getting rid of a train steward could be nice. But right now they're okay. Okay, I think... I think I actually go spells over units. Let's see. Oh, you chose Gorge variant for the boss. Interesting. Yeah, you want to stack the crap out of morsels for him then. Yeah, he starts with lifesteal. I didn't know if lifesteal was permanent. I'm learning how it works. Crucible collector. Gorge gain lifesteal one. That's an interesting unit. Another Morsel Master. Morsel Master seems okay. This guy seems pretty good. If I can upgrade him. Holdover, I love. If I can afford to play it, I could do Holdover, cost three. If I can start chaining this thing. It just gives tons of energy. And then I can put plus 10 damage to this one. Can I afford to do all of that? I think I can. Yeah, I have enough. <laughs> I think that's what I do. It's just this one's so expensive, but it's so good. These frozen lances suck. <laughs> Leave. Yeah, nice pick. I'm happy. Like, I could see 
almost duplicating that card. Enemies enter with 10 armor is a little bit scary. Eh, it's only 10 armor. Gets a unit draft. I don't care much about the unit. Uh, maybe I do. Let's go. I don't have many units. Damn, they have thorns because of her, huh? Yeah. Ooh, I do have this at least. So I can take her out. Or I could take out one this guy. Let's see what morsels I get. Damn. That's not bad. He gets his lifesteal too, so he'll be pretty strong. He takes up three. This takes up one. I could get him plus five, plus five times two. Or I get him plus one and a damage shield. I feel like that plus five, plus five, plus he gets plus three, plus one times two. Miner's the best morsel. Is that? Yeah, that seems really good. This one seems good too. But Miner seems insane. And I start with lifesteal, so that should heal me back up. But if I'm up a level, that might be even better. There's no reason for this guy to be right on the bottom floor, I don't think. Give myself room to play spells if I need to. I don't need the lifesteal yet. He's gaining a bunch. I'm gonna hold off on the Ember Drain. Can't fit him. Nope. Okay, he became big quick. That was pretty lucky. Crucible Collectors, also nice. Damn, I want to get this. I could do it. If I use my Crypt Builder. I think I gotta. A morsel could help me here. It probably would, but I want to kill that more than anything. Okay, now they both die. This turn, I'm hoping to get my spell that's hold over. Damn it, did not get my spell. That's okay, we have lifesteal. Ah, money, yeah, I like money a lot. What does this one do? Oh, it spikes. Okay, let's see what more soul we get. Eater gains plus a two attack and life steal one is pretty nice, so I get two more life steal. I mean, there's no reason not to play the other. Let's see what I get? Gain energy. Nah. Energy would be nice right now, though. Plus, he gains health, so he gets back the two health that he's losing, and he gets more damage. Train stewards, I don't care. Oh, I could put my other morsel up here. Yes, yes, yes. Cool. Top floor for energy. Good call. Okay. So now, this... I think we'll kill like two of these. And if it doesn't, it'll do a ton of damage to him. I could get my morsel for, it doesn't matter. Let's just try it and see what we get. Killed one of them, so. Got me two energy back. I, Crypt Builder doesn't do much. Gain energy, not the best, but might be helpful for next time. Put it here. He becomes bigger. Floor capacity. Okay, so I am over capacity. Interesting. 
can't put this out. Could put it out up here. End the turn. That one does get up to my pyre to do. I think she did very little damage. Okay. This should kill one. Okay, never mind. That should do a ton of damage. Collect. Did take pyre damage, but not much. Okay. Apply Rage 2 and Ember Drain 2 to a friendly unit. Gain 2 energy. That could be kind of nice. The Ember Drain 2 is just scary. Ooh, okay. That's pretty nice. I think I'm avoiding these because of the Ember Drain, even though the two energy would give me more for that turn. They really want to give you that crap card. Yeah, they do. This one seems okay. 1x damage shield. Production is bad. Rage 2 doesn't help. Yeah, I was just thinking for the two energy, but it's getting one good turn and then crappy next turn. The only way this would be good is if I had carry over your energy because then this could give me enough to use my spells to get more energy that I would carry over and outlast these two turns. Life steals good. Yeah, I can see that. Okay. None of these seem... Ah, this one's okay. It just costs two. I already have enough stupid crypt builders. I have two of them. Discard at random kind of works with the crypt builder. Could just skip this card. The whole thing is... Right now, I don't have to spend any energy on units, so big spells are kind of nice to have. But do I just want morsels, kind of? End boss will be cutting stacks in half. Probably the easiest variant. The end is near. This incarnation of Hell's Greatest Foe has the power of cleanse all units of effects which don't benefit Srath. This fight will require more than sheer strength. Interesting. I think I'm going to take this. It's a decent spell to upgrade. Ooh. That's kind of nice just to send him out there to get killed. Or to encant a bunch. He only takes up one space. Ah, but he's one car. I don't know. We'll see. Artifact, Steigen, Umbra, Magic. I don't have much money. It's the main problem. I think we skip the Magic Shop, even though I would like to upgrade my spells. Ah. So I could afford right now to get one big upgrade, one small upgrade. And the Umbra unit might be decent. I think the artifact's better at this point. Just save money. Stick him behind the other gorger and try to remember to cast spells on this level. Yeah, might do that. That'll probably be the plan. Or just stick him behind wherever and he'll die off as I cast spells. 50% chance to apply spell weakness. That's nice. 25% chance to deal 5 damage. That can take out small guys, which is nice, but I'll take... Yeah, I have some big spells. This works with the big spells. I don't care too much about these. I guess of the two, he's better, but... Eh. I don't want a unit up front because he would eat my morsels. I think we're skipping. I don't need them. Wait, what? Nope, I want this. 
Nice tank, but you don't need... Yeah. It, life steal seems really good. If I can make it work. Okay. I do like the pyre damage one. Ah, <sighs> Consume. Restore 2x pyre health. I guess I never go heal, though. Pyre damage. Pyre damage can be so nice. Let's take this. Could have just skipped that, too, but... Eh. In this game, I don't worry about pyre health at all. Maybe I should. Maybe as things get tougher. Constructed explosive... Or er, damage shield. Okay. They have a damage shield. That hurts a little. Spell damage, I think, goes through it, though. Damn, I got all my units, and I can play them, and I could do a morsel. Or I could just take him out. So it's just a question of, is the morsel worth more than just taking him out? I don't want to put my units on this floor. I could set up on this floor. But he'll use up some of his... I might just build on the top floor. In which case, I think it's worth it more to start charging him up than it is to kill this unit. Common or uncommon. Yeah, okay. Not the best. Yeah, start eating more so it's just I'm having to build all the way up top, which kind of sucks. I need more space for units for sure. This unit I don't play. Much as I would like to. He can go on the second floor later, maybe. Hmm hmm hmm. Which one do I want to hit with this? Let's kill the damage dealer for sure. Three attack. Ooh, damage shield is pretty nice. Right now he has 40 HP. Ah. So if I eat two morsels... I'll be up to 32. If I do this, I'll be up to 38. I'll almost get to kill this guy. Oh, I can kill him using a spell. He has spell weakness, so this will do 12. Let's take the damage shields. Yeah. Oh, I should have played this guy first. That was a mistake. Could have encanted. So does this actually work? I guess it would. Okay. I could have put him out still. Probably should have. This stupid thing. I don't have a way to pop. It's going to do some damage. That's fine. Could add more... Well, no, because it'll just pop one of his shields. No, because this guy will pop... Yeah, this guy pops one shield, this guy pops the second shield. There's no benefit to putting out the train steward, really.
Damage shield doesn't mix well with life steal. Yeah, I mean, I can see that. The main thing. Oh, it still uses up the life steal stack. No, he used the life steal stack to heal. I was hoping that. No. Every attack he uses a life steal, even if it doesn't heal, I think. Okay. This is probably worth it. This kills all three of them and gives me a bunch of energy. Crypt Builder would just kill the front guy. Morsel's also nice, though. It's just I can get this card rolling like over and over again. And yeah, I end up with a ton of energy. Okay, could put a bunch of damage shields on somebody. He is going to be out of lifesteal. Putting five damage shields seems decent. But right now, he can't kill both of these. He can only kill one. Let's just use this. Even though it doesn't work great with him, still do it. End the turn. I think this level I cast this. Okay. That was pretty nice. Let's see what we get. Gain energy. Not the best, but every morsel he eats is good. I guess put you out, because why not? Okay, end the turn. Ooh, I get to restore my pyre health. That's nice. This pays for itself. This is the final attack. Life steal would be nice. Damn. Six pyre health. I. How much do I care? Can we kill him? I don't have much life steal. But he doesn't do much damage. I think we'll be able to kill him anyways. My spells are big. Hmm. <sighs> Damn. So I can do 80 damage with that spell, or I can get one morsel. I think it's more worth it to do the 80 damage. This guy's free. Cool. I guess this guy's also free. I should have played that first. That was stupid of me. Oh, I should have at least put him out front so that he would tank. That was really stupid. I could have put him out front up here. Doesn't matter. We're going to get to kill this guy. Okay. Now we do want the life steal, even though damage shield doesn't help a ton. Doesn't matter. Mistakes were made. I'm learning. Plus five magic power, deal 30x damage to the front enemy unit. Ooh, apply trample. Trample seems pretty big. 30x damage also seems 
big and this doesn't get consumed this does i think tramples more what we're going for but god if i have a lot of energy this is nice if you set up second floor earlier next time damage shield can go on one and life steal to the other yeah i could see that let's take <sighs> this one's so insane There aren't great upgrades for it, is the only thing. Well, yeah, there are. The minus one cost, I don't know if that works with it. Let's just take Trample. Gain one damage shield is kind of nice. We want more space. Oh, the only problem is the morsel will still overspill, fill that space. Okay, what would I duplicate? Really quickly, duplicate gold Steigen. I have some gold. I could upgrade units. I don't want the pyre help. Upgrade champion. So I'm leaning towards this one. I could get rid of two of those stupid frozen lances. Duplicating this is interesting. It's almost too much though. I have to be able to kill <laughs> at least four units a turn, like two on each floor. I wouldn't be able to hold over both, but I would get one sooner. This one's kind of nice. I could put two Morsel Masters on a floor, and then I would get three copies of a Morsel, since really I can't put... I can only put one Morsel with this guy and this guy, because it'll get duplicated, so it'll take up all the space anyways. I don't know what else I want to duplicate, really. Well, I could upgrade a unit, then duplicate, too. That could make this one nice to upgrade. This one's already fully upgraded. Oh! No, upgrade a unit, not a spell. That's a spell. Um, lifesteal, damage shield. Oh yeah, morsel master. Boss, two masters. Drop a morsel. You'll have seven on the floor? What? Holy crap. Really? Okay, we're going this route. We'll try that. I was thinking it would do three. But yeah, maybe for the one we'll put out two, I don't know. Or you're just saying I'll have seven, I don't know. We'll see what happens. <laughs> this is kind of scary to do. <laughs> it would actually make this totem kind of big. I don't have any multi-hits. That makes this not super valuable. Encant with gain one armor is kind of nice. Oh, you might be right. Six on the floor. You mean six morsels, though? No. I was thinking it would just end up with three morsels. I don't know. I don't know how to think of this at all. Lifesteal and armor seem kind of good together. None of these really seem great, to be honest. <laughs> I 
I just don't need them. Six units, boss. Two masters, three morsels. Okay, so yeah, three morsels. Okay, got ya. Three morsels still seems good. I think I do duplicate him. I just don't know how much it helps for a morsel. I just don't know what else I would put on him other than... Like, quick would be really nice. I don't have too much money. I don't care about the armor much. Let's put this on here. Reroll. And I might just purge. Multi-strike is kind of nice. Damage shield too, so... Okay. But he goes in the back. So if I'm going to copy this guy, this at least makes him do some damage too. Two strong morsel masters, my boss, and a bunch of morsels. The only thing that would be nicer would be quick, would be super nice, but we'll take it. Okay, I have the 50 to purge right now. Damage shield 2 doesn't help a ton. I think we just purge. And get rid of one of these frozen lances. Or a train steward. These cost me zero to play, though. I really just don't like these. Remember, your other gorger should be the damage shield one. Yeah, over the lifesteal guy. I just don't plan on... I'm feeding all my morsels to one person, really. Like, you can't feed to two different... I guess... My main guy gets big stats from eating. I guess this is on a different floor, though. For when I have excess morsels. Like... I want a morsel guy with a non-morsel guy. So this might go on one floor, this on one floor, and then my boss on one floor. And train stewards might go with them, behind them. Shouldn't have that many morsels. I agree. Oh wait, did you pick up a Thorger, third Gorger? Yeah, I. it was that or Tangled. I don't really care which one I get first, honestly. Purge a card. We're getting rid of Frozen Lance. Let's go. Getting rid of all my frozen lances. Could get rid of the stewards, but between the two. I do have some encants. We'll get rid of one steward. Stupid pyre's healed. Now I regret taking that heal pyre card. Gorge seems big. What? Okay, now I have to think. So I'm at six capacity. Oh, why did I think? I was thinking about that all wrong. That was remove two cards, not duplicate a card. This was the duplicate side. Okay. So, I want more space, I think. I don't get to duplicate my guy. That's fine. Let's take this. I'm making all kinds of mistakes. I just looked at the picture and thought I understood it. Okay, they get plus six attack. I can live with that. Let's go. What floor do I want people on? I do get a bunch of morsels at least. Let's see what morsels we get. That's pretty nice. Okay, so when I put him down... 
I should have enough room now that I get to play both of these with him. I think he's just gonna go on this floor. We have tons of room. This guy actually does damage. So having one more unit down that's just one space on this floor would be kind of nice, except I only have people that eat morsels. This guy, I don't care about too much. End the turn. Oh, crap. I need to kill them off before they put these stupid things into my hand. And I don't have a great way to kill him yet. Three damage to the pyre. Pyre's at full health. I could take out this front guy, he would eat the second. <laughs> my damage shield guy, I could do whatever with. This does card draw. Or... Can we get high enough to kill him and this back guy? Right now... I don't know if I eat the morsels. I probably eat the morsels after. Do I eat them before I attack? That's kind of important to me. 60 damage. We're doing 41. He does 15. If I can do just a little bit more, then we'll kill both of these, which is fine. I don't have spells for this guy. Let's put him back there. Oh, this is a spell. Stupid steward. Could have put the steward out first. Just to let it... Ah, it would have done more damage to. Let it die. These guys would kill the steward. They would also kill him, though. End the turn. He dies, but he did get to put another of these in here. Gotta kill this guy. God, I don't do much damage, and he dies as is right now. Play this. He dies because of that one. The room has reached the unit limit on one of its sides. For that side, effects like ascend and descend will fail. If the enemy side is full, enemies moving up the train will bypass the room. That's good to know. Okay, so this would kill him. Wouldn't do anything here. He's already dead. Okay. Spell weakness doesn't do a whole lot. Could get more card draw, but what is it going to draw me? Nothing too useful. I think we just do the little bit of damage, put these out just to get them out of my hand. Problem is, this guy doesn't get big quick enough at all. Trample would be nice, but he 
again, doesn't do enough. Damn it. End the turn. I need my stupid holdover spell. There it is. Okay, so up here, it will kill three of them. If I did it here, it would kill probably two of them. <sighs> of course I get two of those. Lifesteal is nice. At least the trample should kill them both in one hit, so he'll only use up one of his life steals. Use my spell should kill two of those. Hopefully. Dead. Okay. He's doing seven damage. Might be more worth it. No, we're doing bigger damage up here. I think we just keep feeding this guy. Now this guy could go up here though. End the turn. Okay. He's dead already. This won't kill him. Oh, that's only if it kills. Correct. Pyre of health, it's already at max. Might as well use it. Put our life steals on here. Put our life steals on. End the turn. Kimiko, thank you for the cheer. Thank you for the bits. I don't have notifications set up for bits yet. I don't think. I definitely need to do that. Watching some Monster Train? <laughs> I have it for all the other alerts, I think. I still don't know how it works for bits. Plus energy on this floor. Or, plus space. That's pretty nice. I like that a lot. Apply Damage Shield 2, Rage 6, and Ember Drain 3. I'm trying to think. You were doing the Twitch Sings last night, I think. And I think I caught... Your stream was the first one that I think I did the... Whatever that's called. The watch party watching around. Or watching along. I don't know. I've been checking out a lot of streams. But I'm pretty sure that was you. Gem Trove. Apply Damage Shield 1 to friendly units. Add three uncommon or rare morsel units to your hand. That's kind of tempting. Damn. This seems in. Oh no, that's Ember Drain. Never mind. This seems insane. This seems good. Let's take the more room. I could skip, or I can do Dazed One. Dazed One is. Pretty nice. Let's take it. I'm taking way too many cards. I always take too many cards. I need more card draw. Okay, I have money. I could get more money. My units don't need to be upgraded, really. My pyre doesn't need to be healed either, though. Okay, let's go this way. Give me something amazing. The end of your turn, frozen cards are reduced to zero. Plus two capacity on middle floor. 
I'm gonna have so much capacity. Wow. I like that. <laughs> Leave. Oh. <sighs> I don't even need this. Overheal the pyre. Ah, spell shield two for 150 coins. I. Well, it's only spell shield. Ah, I use spells. Let's skip that one. I hate spell shield. I hate damage shield. I hate all shields. <laughs> we get so much space on this floor. Stupid amounts of space. So, at this point, the question becomes, do I put another guy down here? And I might. It's just, where do I even put him? Doesn't really matter. I mean, I might as well. I still have room to put three morsels on here with him. He does big damage. Let's take it. Or he does decent damage. And the turn. Oh, except I would want to put this guy. I think I still put that guy. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. I need a sweep unit that can sit back here, really. So now I can only put two morsels, but that's still a good amount. They just skipped their attack. Not the most helpful. But, oh, discard your hand, too. I guess this guy goes up here. This gets consumed. No reason to play it now except to get it out of my hand. But I might need it. I probably will need it. End turn. Umbra are tricky, because this guy's harder to power up than the demon guys are. Damn, when they die, it also gives him armor. Forgot about that. Okay, because of the dazed, this guy stays alive. That's interesting. That's actually kind of funny. Damn, with Crypt Builder, I could kill him. Gotta do it, I think. Okay, now two of these die at least. It's just the healer left. I don't care about the healer. Hmm. Why not? End the turn. Okay. There's a bunch of my morsels. They use up all of my energy unless... I play a spell here. Let's see what I get. Oh yeah. Every time I play one, I get more stuff. He has spell weakness, so this would actually kill him in one hit. And do 20 more damage to this guy. I think? 
49 plus 12. Yeah. This guy's gaining armor is the problem. Um, 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 um. Tough call. Damage shield's nice. I think we just do this. Why did those not get multiplied? When you summon a morsel on this floor, create a copy. Okay, never mind. They. Why do I only see three of them, not four? What happened? Something went wrong there. I feel like that's a bug or I'm misunderstanding something. One of the two. Okay, I finally get this. Could use it up here and it pays for itself, but barely. Crypt Builder. I think this guy might survive. If I use it here, it'll probably kill three of them. No, because these two are hard to kill. Never mind. Let's just use it up here. Crypt Builder would kill him. Doesn't help a whole lot. Got two of those. Okay. Got all four that time. I don't know why I feel like I did not get all of them last time. Um. <laughs> I mean, I'm getting big energy next turn. This could be a time to put on more lifesteal, but I'm already getting more lifesteal. Trample doesn't help much. Damage shield is pretty nice. This will kill two, so it pays for itself. Have a bunch of energy. Just need the card draw, I think. Why did that not do... Oh, because my card draw deck guy died. I should have just put more damage shields up. Five times five. Holy crap, I need sap on him. He's going to pop all five of those damage shields. If I do this, I can still play two morsels. If I get them. Okay. <laughs> Dazed is nice. Eighty damage. Eighty damage is probably more worth it than it depends what morsel I get two of. Lifesteal would be big. Ah, 
I got the stupid energy one. That's not good. Well, dazed is nice. And the turn. You can do it, top floor guy. Maybe. He's only taking 20 damage as it stands. Okay, but we get to do Ember Drain. Ah, it's gonna go to... It doesn't matter anyways. Oh, there's no room for him. No, he's still gonna one-hit kill this guy. Yeah, that doesn't help any. Damn. This is gonna hurt. This... 25. I do 30 damage. That is so rough. I made terrible choices. Okay, my first Umbra run did not go great. But I feel like I learned a lot. Add a Morsel Miner to your hand. Cost two, but those ones are good. Shade Lamp. The first time each turn an enemy unit dies, add two Morsel units to hand. Hmm. Interesting. That works good with some spells. 